Guess what? What happened at nap time, Sebastian? I can't bet. Hello everyone, we are about to start our nap, but we have had breakfast and we have gone to class and we have had work and school time and we had lunch. Those are all the things we have done. This little guy was having a little bit of playtime while I get things ready for now. Well, we don't have time right now, okay? So I'm gonna get your cream and your diaper stuff and we're gonna get all ready for nap, okay? Okay. Hey guys, I left you when I was starting nap, but guess what? What happened at nap time, Sebastian? I can't nap. You got out of bed, you didn't nap. We ended up having, please don't carry your food around, just go clean it off if it's hairy. We ended up just having a quiet time in his room. I stayed with Ziggy because Ziggy was sleeping. He is used to his puppy nap. Um, Sebastian ended up pooping in his diaper twice. That was fun. I don't know what's going on, but I guess that's why he didn't nap. He is exhausted now. Um, I'm just trying to catch up on work. More came in today, and they are gonna watch the Grinch. This was a short one, what can I say? It was a class day, so we were out and about early, but I couldn't film it because it's so many kids in there. Um, after that, I've just been working today and dealing with a non-napping toddler, working some more. My husband has gone out. We had dinner early with him here at home. Then he went to see some friends at a brewery. Uh, the kids, as I said, watched The Grinch and they both pretty much paid attention to it, which is impressive for Sebastian, but he's just really exhausted, so I think that was about all he could handle tonight. Uh, it's about 7.30, 7.40. We are upstairs to start the bedtime process. He is building me a tower that I'm about to go see. Um, yeah, hopefully it'll get more exciting for you guys to watch, but yeah, I made it past the Christmas work rush, but now I'm into January. I'm always about a month ahead. In January, one of my clients has an anniversary, so there's a lot of posters and hats and stuff for that anniversary party and a music festival. And then another client is having me do some Super Bowl themed things. Doggies and Super Bowls, so that's fun. I know nothing about football though, so I'm like brainstorming ideas when I couldn't use the look that they used last year, which was a field and a football, and that's like the first thing I think of. But they accepted my draft, so I'm gonna move on and finish that stuff up tomorrow. Also tomorrow, we have our La Leche League meeting, so I'll be doing that at Panera. I don't typically film that, and I don't know what else. Oh yes, we have book club. We, because we no longer have swim on Thursdays, I was able to sign Jax up for the new book club they had. They used to do a homeschool book club. It was like Mondays during the day, which is great, easy to fit in my schedule. But they moved it to 7 p.m. on Thursdays and just opened it up to everybody because a bunch of our homeschool community here in the area moved away. And it's a big bummer and we shrunk massively and they just didn't feel like the turnout would be good enough. I don't know, it might have been the Maker Mondays certainly have a good turnout, but I guess the book clubs are more narrow age range, so I can see what they're doing, but we are going to try it out. This will be the first month he's going. I'm going to have to bring Sebastian. I'm sure my husband will be out. He's been taking care advantage of the fact that we don't have to go out to swim on Thursdays, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, hopefully there's a nap. Things are not the best when there's no nap. I've got Ziggy because my husband's out. He is already curled up trying to go to sleep. Um, let's go see that castle. Wow, is that a marble run? Yeah. Well, how did it go?
Whoa, that's pretty good actually. <laughs> Maybe you did it backwards. Does it start on that end? Um. Oh. He's in a hole. He got trapped. Is there anything you want to say to everybody before we say goodnight? Oh, get here! <laughs> You're hiding. Who is hiding? What happened to these people? She, they were mean, so they got crap. All these people were mean? Yeah. What happened to their Christmas spirit? Um. I thought people were usually more cheerful right before Christmas. Hey, Do you yeah, think you can let them escape? No. No? Hmm. That's a shame. Ugh. Now. Hmm. Anyway, I'm going to say goodnight to everybody. Do you want to say goodnight? Yeah, we go. <laughs> hmm. That's not very nice. Now. Eh. Ah. Uh, what? I think you have too many people in there, you're gonna break your bag. Here we go! Ha <laughs> ha! You sound like the Grinch man. Not kind at all. I don't like that. Hey, well, what may maybe consider being sweeter to your toys. What do you think? Maybe that you can be nicer to them? Oh, no. How about we get changed for bed, okay? Going back in here. Alright. I don't know, you can't really reason with a three year old who has a nap. We'll just let that go for now. And I'm gonna say good night. Good night everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Say good night. Good night. Dude, you got the phone. Sorry. You don't hit the phone. So you're sorry to them, you just threw them on the floor. Sorry. Can you do it gently? Say good night. Good night. Good night.